Good morning all of you respected teachers and all my viewers. I am Sneha Rob Stander, 10D from Bikas Vidyalaya Dhumri Vigusrai and I am here for one of the presentation that is human female reproductive system. Firstly, I am here for explaining the female reproductive system. It is the system which helps the female to reproduce their young ones. The reproductive system of female comprises of two different parts. First one is primary reproductive system or necessary reproductive system and second one is accessory reproductive system. The example of primary reproductive system is of ovaries and the accessories are pair of ovary duct, uterus, vagina and vulva. If primary or necessary reproductive system is damaged, then whole function of reproduction will be damaged or not be conducted. But if the accessory parts are damaged, then no much problem are been occurring. The female reproductive system consists of pair of ovaries, a pair of oviduct, uterus, vagina and vulva. The main function of female reproductive system are to produce egg, receive the sperm, provide the site for fertilization, implantation of the growing embryo and development of fetus. It also provides hormones that control the various stages of ovulation and maintenance of pregnancy. Now, I would like to explain all the parts of the female reproductive system. First one is ovary, which is the necessary or accessory part of the reproductive system. It is paired oval-shaped organ located in the abdominal cavity near the kidney. It produces thousands of ova or egg cells. The ovary matures one egg at a time in alternate month. It secretes female sex hormones like estrogen and progesterone. Next organ is oviduct. It is also known as fallopian tube. It is in pair of tubes of about 12 cm in length. It has a funnel shaped op opening near the ovary. It carries ova or egg from the ovary to the uterus. It is the site of fertilization. These open into a uterus from both of sides. Now for the uterus explanation. Uterus is inverted pear-shaped structure, broad on the upper end and narrower on the lower end. The upper end is called the body of the uterus and the lower end is called the cervix. At the upper end, it receives the oviducts of either side, whereas the lower end of it open into vaginal canal that opens to the outside. It is also called as the site of implantation. The next organ is cervix. It is the lower and the narrow portion of uterus which opens into the vagina. Muscles of cervix control the opening and closing of uterus. Now next organ is vagina. It is 9 cm long. It receives the sperm from the male partner. It makes the environment. Its environment is acidic and it serves as a birth canal. That's all for the video. Thanks for watching.